Uh, welcome to my presentation about theatre company Complicité. They are a British theatre company founded in 1983 and they are based in London. They were originally set up by Steve, Simon McBurney, Annabelle Arden and Marcelo Magni. They all started off touring in a small yellow post office van. Um, their works include ad adaptations of writings and classic texts where they include a wide range of techniques including the use of technology. Uh, their first performance was Put In Your Head, which they originally went on tour with. Um, Complicité is based on physical theatre and performing plays using movement and mind instead of ordinary dialogue. Annabelle Arden is one of the co-founders of Complicité. She is an actress and a theatre and opera director. Her latest show was in 2018 and it was for Opera North. Simon McBurney, OBE, uh, he's the main founder of Complicité and also is their artistic director. He is a British, British actor, writer and director. Uh, he's well known for playing Cecil the Choir Master and the Vicar of Dibley. Marcello Magni is also another of the co-founders of Complicité. He's an Italian actor and he's quite well known for voicing over characters in the Child series Pingu. So Put It, Put it On Your Head is their first show that they ever done and it's in 1983. It's a fantasy of, about the English seaside and the social agonies of English, Englishness on the beach. It's about four characters who fail to like, deal with the changes that they come across. Uh, it uses physical and comical theatre and the ideas for this originate from circus traditions and silent movies. They toured in 1983 going to the following places. Uh, that's a picture of them and it's the three that founded it. They're in that picture along with um, another actor that they got to help them out. A culture of complicity. Um, the creation of their work and their performances is taken on by the whole company, including all the performers, directors, writers, and everyone else involved. And um, they do this to bring their ideas together and like present themselves as a whole unit instead of like individuals. Um, they use an ex exploration process to give the actors a chance to let their bodies and brains work freely and it just also helps them like, warm up and get ready for whatever they're going to come across. Um, every performance requires a different response each time a show is created. This makes every one of their shows unique. However, all the shows originate from improvisation. And um, Complicite are always ready to improvise to get themselves out of bad situations, such as like forgetting movement, which is a good skill to have in Complicite, it adds to the excitement of every performance. Um, in rehearsals, they often like use a beat or a rhythm. This is to, to warm up the characters' bodies and um, also it helps them ide easily like, identify cues and stuff. So the aim of Complicité is to come together as one and to make the audience feel they are watching um, a collective group perform rather than just a group of individuals. Uh, so we've got two pieces of their works here, uh, their most famous one being a disappearing number. And this is a device piece based on a true story between the co collaboration of two mathematicians who made the most important mathematical discoveries of the 20th century. Another one of their shows is Shun King, which had uh, an all Japanese cast and was performed using movements and the use of puppets. Um, the second show, Shun King, also won 
um, Simon McBurney an award for best director. Uh, this is some pictures of their performances in that that they've done over the years. So yeah, that's Complicite and thank you for listening to my PowerPoint.